Rod, we finally have you surrounded. This time, we are gonna hunt you down. No, stupid children. Have you not realized where you are? Huh? Oh, I am so sick of you. I'm going to break you into a thousand little pieces with this little freeze gun here. <laughs> <laughs> Filthy children, you won't make me think about my past again. Uh-uh. If I destroy you, everything that happens in my head will disappear forever. Like my frosty breath in winter. It will vanish. Thinking about tough times in the past. Kids at school were mean about my weight. None of them were still breathing. And my dad, who was my main family, was guilty for my fatness because he had the secret recipe to make poison ice cream too. And he was too, he was too carefree with I don't understand. Did, did he move me from that convent because of that recipe? It's sad because he never really loved me. As a parent, he, he, he seemed more interested in being famous and rich. And my mom, the only one who actually cared about me, was a crazy nun who, who treated me like a girl. Is she still alive? Did, did she kill my dad for revenge? And if my real dad wasn't Joseph, was he that evil lord named Baphomet? <laughs> and whatever I 
to already do, I can't undo the mistakes of the past. Life feels meaningless. My revenge and my dreams, like ice cream on a summer night, are melting away. We both know quite well. Worldly matters are handled with care. With care. But shall we embark, Brother Nazareth, and take on the dare? Sister, it's been a while since our talk began. Can't say your real name. You still hidden in the shape of a magical cup. What's your suggestion? What's your plan? Rod, the human creature you brought to life, Mr. Madeline, is repentance. Don't you think he deserves one chance? I can hug you again. I am very sorry for everything that happened. Please forgive me. I love you. You are my mother? Yes, it's me. Finally, I recognize you as my son, a grown man. I hope we get to know each other in the afterlife. Mom! Dad! We were so worried. You just disappeared without saying anything to us. Uh, but Jay, what happened? You have also gained a lot of weight. Is that possible? My goodness. Ah, Chloe, stop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> It has been quite the adventure. I'll tell you everything when we get home. <laughs>